Hopefully we can find one. Can't wait to be settled. We're Peter and Lisa Hoppy. We've left wonderful, colorful Colorado to move closer to families and to find a home that won't break the bank as bad. Since Peter's job allows him to work anywhere with Wi-Fi. City Wi-Fi still have full coverage right here. We did a nationwide house search for our first home. Can we find the right place for us at the right price? Five Who cares if it's hard? All you need is one. Welcome to the Happy Hoppy Home Hunt in this series of Finding, Finding Home. home. It's been difficult trying to find a three month apartment lease. We just need a short term lease as we are looking for a home here in Indiana. Earlier this day, we realized we wanted to buy a house near the Eagle Creek area. And so now we need to research apartments that were close to that. All right, so that was pretty pointless to uh, call the apartments because then they're like, oh, we'll put you on our waiting list or whatever although it says they have available now but they couldn't tell us if they had available so we're just gonna go in person the problem was <laughs> we were getting a call center basically so yeah. it wasn't actually the leasing agents at the office so we're just gonna go to the offices yep and so we have six that we want to check out and these are ones that we had then like saving uh, and looking at ahead of time if we just went straight through that'd be like three o'clock by the time we were done However, we're definitely gonna be longer than that. So, we'll probably make our decision today, but may not get into place until tomorrow. Looks nice. It does look nice. Let's check it out. The pricing I just gave you is for 12 months. If you needed to do um, six or nine, it's a $75 premium per so month. Do you do one or three months? We do not do yeah. three months. Unfortunately, not not the place for us, but um, it's okay. that was super all helpful. Needs one. All we need is one. Unfortunately, <laughs> is actually fortunately, it's narrowing the decision down really easily. Right, right. She was I like, think, uh, I don't think you're gonna be able to find like a three month. I just need one lady. We just need one. <laughs> See someone Georgia. that's willing to work with us. <laughs> we might be there longer, but probably minimum three months. And we're visiting a bunch of different places today to try to find some that hopefully we can move into like today or tomorrow, ideally. Okay. What's the shortest lease that you guys? Uh, we do offer three month leases. And with that being said, it's just a hundred dollar premium, which is included in your monthly rent amount. Oh, okay. Well, with the hundred dollars included, that makes it seven dollars Okay. So it's potentially an option if we run into the same issues as everybody else. Yeah. We allow you to do three month lease, but if you do, then it's a hundred extra dollars um, per month for that short term lease. And then if we find that, hey, we actually need to stay here, for another month, then it's an extra $200 to extend the lease by month by month. So that could get expensive fast because we don't know exactly how long we'll be in here. Seeing all this, we might end up just finding a private individual that can be more flexible because these, these lease Why places- Why you up so early? Well, these- This was the second place. I give up easily. Because these lease places, they have to go by a specific thing where like a private individual is more understanding and we are good renters and we always pay on time and we have good credit and yeah. We yeah, could, we'll see. Yeah. On to the next few, we'll see what happens. Yep. Cross that line when we get there. Okay. So what next, keep going, move, come on, let's roll. No big deal. I'll take it personally. Uh, I'm not taking it personally, I just wanna find a good place and be settled. Bottom line is, at that price, we could just do a hotel. Yeah, exactly. So it was gonna be eight fifty. Eight fifty. Yeah, we can find Airbnbs for cheaper than that. Well, this looks cute. Let's go see how many arms and legs these guys want. <laughs> like two weeks. Two weeks would be the soonest. Yeah. Okay. So for a short-term lease, it would be a premium of 150 on top of that. Okay. Gotcha. All right. So plus 150. Right. Probably not. Thank but you. thank you. Of course. <laughs> Absolutely. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah. It's a nice place though.
All right, that was a quick no. So we've just exhausted our list. <sighs> and nothing. Well, there's that one, that 715 per month, plus an $80 application fee, plus another like 40 to $80 a month for electric, plus another $50 for Wi-Fi. It adds up fast. <clears throat> All right, so let's expand our area. We started in the location that we were preferring to be. Yes. There are apparently places on the east side that you can do so, short-term rental. Let's go to the Scarborough Lake sister property, the one that um, that's 30 minutes from here. 403, and traffic is not terrible. Um, they apparently here do short-term leases without an additional fee. It doesn't look, look like they have any available though until next week. Alrighty, so, oh, there's leaf blowers, so it's loud. Um, so they also have a premium for short-term leases and they don't have any available until the earliest next Friday. So we have to find someplace else for a week. So at that point, no good. How many apartments can we see before six o'clock? All right, let's see. All right, so at this location, you have to rent for at least a year if it's your first time renting with this um, property management company, I guess. So, no go. Very small, so I doubt they have any space. Yeah. Huh, we'll see what we find here. I'm doubtful. All right, so that could be a possibility. Um, they're actually about the same price, a little bit cheaper than the place in Scarborough, but here it's just a studio, and it's only, what'd you say, 400 square feet? Not even. So I was curious, and I looked up short-term leases um, on it for Indianapolis online, and the place popped up that like they, it's fully furnished and they apparently then partner with different uh, uh, properties here and so they have it all furnished for you. The price includes Wi-Fi and all this stuff. So I was just curious how much it would be and the cheapest was $2,100 a month for a three month lease. They didn't have that as a one month thing. They said that is usually more expensive. So goodness. That is definitely not worth it because we can um, get into this place um, for like with everything, utilities and everything should be around like $8.40 a month. So yeah, I think I think that might be where we end up. We'll see. The place I call was like Blue Corporate Apartments something, I don't know. Yeah, Blue Corporate Housing. We looked up like um, hotels here and if we did like a hotel that has like a kitchen um, it's, uh, let's see, the cheapest was like $41 a night, so like $1,200 a month for that. Okay. Number 10. Uh, nope. I think we're going back to Scarborough. We thought that was high, but now we're finding... We have more to go. We have like I four know. or five more. Okay, let's try them all. Try them all. There's a lot of apartments here no, in Indianapolis. No, just the ones that came up as supposedly <laughs> be available for short term and yeah. in the budget we were looking at. Right, yeah. Online, obviously, when you see the price, that's that's like 500, 600 per month. That's if you're due a 12 month. But we want a three month. This looks like a college dorms. Yeah. Inside looks a lot nicer. All right, we'll see. Nope, they don't do short-term leases. One year is the minimum. All right, so it is 10 to six. Uh, most of the places are closed now, so we are done looking for apartments today. together. 
sorry, I was a pain earlier and all stressed out. Thanks. <laughs> All right, it is day two of the apartment hunt. Now, we didn't even think we would get to this until today. So yesterday was really awesome that we were able to start looking for apartments. We're looking at three more this morning. Yep. Three more this morning, and then making a decision between those three and then the one that we saw yesterday that we liked. So, let's see if we can find our apartment. Woo! <laughs> available right now is 910 a month it's $75 per person for the application fee um, the deposit is only 300 bucks so that's not bad but then there's also a $200 admin fee and the minimum they do is six months so no nope. more. <laughs> 830 traffic is pretty good Woo! and it wasn't bad when we left our hotel at 730 either where are we going my goodness Was six fifty nine a month, but they want an extra two hundred fifty dollars a month for a three month lease. What? what? Nah, not happening. An extra hundred a month makes sense. An extra two fifty? No Outrageous. way. Outrageous. Ooh, pretty. Here, swim by here and see the set. I think they only do seven months is the shortest, but we'll see if they do a three month. I hear you. Actually, no one's ever asked me that. Let me ask my team manager. Hey. Question. Yes. Um, so they're looking to move like a, as soon as possible, and they're looking for a three month lease. Now, uh -huh. if they were to, let's say they moved in tomorrow and they paid all three months in advance, would that change the 150 for the three month lease? Or they would, I don't know, I guess. Um, they wouldn't be able to do that just because the utilities on that third month. They're not going to know what the utilities are. Ooh, yep. No, that price is not included to you. So water, trash, and sewage is going to be additional to this 760. I mean, it's a little more. It's a little more. Um, do you want to give me your information? Uh, I think at this point, the other place is going to be the better deal. All right, so they're in their runnings. I mean, it's still more, plus the utilities aren't included, and it's $45 more per month, where the other one included some of the utilities. So. They only include water and trash. Yeah, which we don't know how much that is. And this is studio here, where the other one's a one bedroom. She's got coffee cups everywhere here. Yeah, I do. She's got a coffee addiction. Oh, yeah. All right, last one. And then we make our decision. After 15 places, we're a little bit like, all right, let's just... Pick one and decide. They all start to look good. And how soon are you guys looking really? Ideally today if possible, as soon as possible. So I mean We do have one yeah. that will look for today, so nice. right now. And I'm gonna look just because it just doesn't seem right. We so, got a special deal. Yeah. On the three month lease. No. That's right. A one bedroom right now on a three month lease, if you were to move in today it would only be Gotcha. We found one for about 200 bucks less than that. So. Did you really? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Where? Scarborough. Scarborough? Oh, okay. Yeah. That makes sense. When you see uh, okay. our apartments, you're yeah. going to be like, okay, like that just. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah. It, it almost rents at that, like at a 12 month lease. Yeah, I was leaving some bases for a little yeah, bit. So. Yeah, yeah. She was shocked, but we weren't. Now we know. 15 places. Let's go to the best priced one. We are hoping they have a bedroom available. They should, because online we saw at least four other ones that said that they were available now, besides the one that they told us about. All right, we're back. Future resident. Well, we think so now. When was the earliest that's available? November 1st. November 1st oh, is the earliest the now. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, okay. That's what I was telling you guys earlier. I know, I know. Yeah. 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 That was fast. Cool. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. Thank you. Thank you.
bummer. Uh, it, someone applied for it online, uh, the other one that was available yesterday. Now, I don't know when they applied. I don't know if they applied overnight or when. Like, we could have done that, but we still wanted to look at some places. Bummer. Now, they applied, but does that mean they've been accepted? Well, she basically sounded like there's nothing she could do about it. So, we gotta look at a couple other things. Dang it. Alright, this is similar to the... All of what we looked at yesterday, it's a sister property. We have a studio that's 288 square feet. That's available now, but that might just be a little too small. We'll have to see. <laughs> Today, um, they have a temp filling in, so she didn't know our answer. She took our name and number, but you know, we gotta make a decision soon. I'm done. She's in full freak out mode. She's like, I just want a place. I'm just done. She's like, I don't care how much money you gotta spend, Peter, just get a place. Yes, that's where I am <laughs> right now. <laughs> And this just, I mean, the properties just seem very basic. And like the studio is only she 200. She just doesn't like this format. I don't like the format. It's only 288 square feet. Like E. So we have to have a one bedroom. And at that point, it's only $20 extra per month to go to the other one that was more secluded and seemed a lot nicer. Are you using my hotspot? I am. Don't, don't mess with it. All right. Let's slow down progress. Oh, okay. I was just gonna look at pictures for the apartment for the other place. Just don't. I, I didn't really look at the inside. We've looked at so many, I don't even know what's what anymore. Exactly, so give me a second to review. Okay. Whew. All right. We just looked at a studio. It's perfect for the time being. I just want to get settled. The kitchen's a little on the old side. That was that was my thing. I'm like, it uh, is. but whatever. It's fine for a little bit. It's fine. I just want to get settled. And this is a really peaceful place back here. And we can move in today. We can move in right now. Oh. <laughs> well, we're gonna have to wait until Monday. That's another 115 bucks for a hotel. Exactly. After we signed the lease, we stayed in the clubhouse for a little bit longer to get some work done and use their table and Wi-Fi. And then finally, we went into our apartment. Home sweet home. Basic. And then up here. So this is a studio, but it's really nice and big for our studio. So I got a walk-in closet, and then like a vanity, and then a nice bathroom. So there we go. Woohoo! All right, time to unpack. Yay, we got settled. We are in an apartment. We unpacked everything that we could, and then we realized, oh yeah, we didn't pack any hangers, and so we have to go and make a Walmart or Target run and grocery store run, so the rest of the evening will be spent doing errands, just getting the rest of the things we need um, to make the apartment home, like basic things like toilet paper. We have to have that. <laughs> So after moving in Friday, we spent the weekend furnishing our apartment with Facebook Marketplace finds and things from Walmart. And then on Monday... What you doing, Peter? Building a standing desk for only $40. Woohoo! It's a DIY Home Depot desk. Yeah, yeah. It ended up costing more than $40 because of the different tools that Peter had to buy, but he was very happy with the finished product. Jacket? No. What's the temperature? Is it cold? It's cold. Oh, it's cold. Getting a jacket. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's better. So, we have been in Indianapolis officially now for a week in our apartment for six days. So yeah, we are so thankful to be here. All right, so we're heading to Avon, which is a suburb, just to be able to check out different parts. Um, plus, we are um, getting some stuff from Walmart there. Peter's getting a lamp for his desk area, so he has light over there. And then the apartment's pretty much complete. We did good in a week. Mm -hmm. It's a studio, it's pretty easy. Yeah. 
All right, we're currently on 21st Street outside the Ring Road. And actually, I really like this area. There's tons of trees. I've been finding a lot of affordable houses down in this area. So, huh. It's a possibility. All right, so welcome to Avon. The lady at our apartment, um, she grew up in Avon and she said this Rockville Road, this US 36 gets really busy around five o'clock. We're here at 1045 and it's, you know, steady traffic. It's like a Powers probably. It's like a Powers. It's like a Powers in Colorado Springs. We compare everything to Colorado Springs. Compared to what we know. <laughs> exactly. Oh, and then apparently now we're in a new county. Marion County is where Indianapolis is. Oh my goodness. It, lots of stores, very wide roads. Looking on the map, I didn't think all of this would be in Avon. Kind of just looked like it was middle of nowhere, but Super wow. Target. Yeah, it's really nice. They have everything you need here. No need to even go into Indy. There's our lamp. What is in this giant box? So this has our shoe rack, which is really not that small. That big? It's really not that big. <laughs> Look at oh it. <laughs> That's it. This little guy. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Overkill. Alright, so that was a nice Walmart. Avon's a nice area. And now our search is now expanded to include Avon. <laughs> <laughs> so that's good. We're, we're cutting things out and then adding other things and eventually, maybe, we'll find home. <laughs> Just the one that is right for us. Thanks for watching the weekly update and yep, stay tuned for more. See you in the next adventure. Bye guys. So easy. Why you make it sound so hard? <laughs> It's so easy. Uh, yeah, like we buy houses every day. Oh goodness. Baby, baby. Whoa! Sweetie, that was Gal not... let me in. Well, you could have just passed it. No! <laughs> Honey, and you got me.